Welcome back, my chrysalis, to some more Slime Rancher. Okay, so in the last episode, we made the exciting, exciting discovery of my career. The Crystal Slime. And so on. So, yeah, it's this little guy on the bottom on, on my third slot there. Um, if you want to see a little bit more of a information on that, here's the arts, just a little close up, and then I'm gonna slowly do a tiny little span there, just in case you haven't seen the last episode where I read that. Okay, there we go. So now we're gonna go and explore more and collect more of these beauties. Oh my god, I love them so much. Oh god, okay. Um, that's a crystal exploding guy. What? That is so awesome. Okay, so they form crystal patterns. And they are paint. They are dangerous to touch. So this is quite a hazardous area, actually. Now that I'm thinking about it, because not only are there crystal slimes uh, everywhere trying to kill things, but there are boom slimes constantly exploding. Um, and I don't know uh, when they'll blow up. Okay. At least there's a little bit of a warning time whenever they do that. Oh God, what's that? What is beautiful? Is it supposed to be just like flowers? It's really pretty. Okay, uh, I'm gonna fly on up over here. They just keep creating like crystal, like spikes everywhere. They're so awesome. Okay, so let's see what we got. I guess I'm gonna walk down here. Oh, hey, buddy. You're my friend now. Okay. Hello. Part of the family. Whoa. Hey. Welcome to the plant. Okay. I almost said Earth, but I'm pretty sure this isn't Earth. Gotta fly over that. Okay. Definitely need water uh, in this area because. It would just make everything a lot easier. Um, okay. Whenever I make a corral for these guys, I cannot be walking into them. They need to be... Uh, I need to install a port collector ASAP. Um, okay, I think I, I think that's it for the area. I, uh, let's just do another little walk around here. I'm gonna fly over here. Okay, so... Oh, okay, here we go. There's a, there's a cave up there. There's a treasure pod here. Um, I'm seeing this, but there isn't anything here. They're still growing. Oh, I just saw... It's a heartbeat. Cool. Actually, the top right is telling me what it is. Alright, awesome. All I gotta do is mouse over it. Oh, hello. There's a box. Uh, let's see what this box got for me. Oh, yeah, I'm falling. Yeah, fly. Okay. Boom! Um, okay. I guess I'll pick up the carrots because I can. Come on, man. There you go. He just ate a heartbeat, and he pooped out two things. In case you didn't know, rock slime's uh, favorite food is heartbeats. And when a slime eats its favorite food, it creates double the uh, plorts. So that was a good little opportunity for anyone who didn't know. And so I just decided to show you. I feel like freaking Jeff Corwin or something. <laughs> if you know who Jeff Corwin is, give me a like. Let me Tell me about it in the comments below. Um, who else was a cool guy? Ah, oh, what's his name? Steve? Steve? What? Steve Irwin? Is that a thing? Steve Irwin? No, I don't think that's his name. It's because there's just there's a guy called Jeff Corwin, and I know he's like an animal. Um, he's he's like one of, he he runs one of those shows where it's like the, he talks about animals and goes up about his day having super awesome animal adventures. Um, what's the other one that that died because of the stingray attack? What's his name? I can't believe I forgot his name because I feel terrible that I forgot his name because I love that guy and I used to watch that stuff all the time. There's a heck ton of stony, can't, stony hens here, so I'm just gonna drop these. Actually, I need them. Whoa, chill, chill, chill. This guy was beelining it. Um, I really want these chickens, though. Uh, I'm gonna ditch the puddles. I'm gonna pick up all these stones, though. Because there's a heck ton, so I'm not really gonna pass up the opportunity. Give me you, give me you. Whoa, hey, welcome back. <laughs> awesome, awesome. Okay. So the chicks will grow up on themselves. You know, I just thought I just made those little chickadees orphans, and I am sorry. Not feel bad. Ah, right, whatever. <laughs> Let's get this. Um, you know what? You can have that. And is that a? What is this? What are these? <gasps> oh, coca. Cool. Uh, crap. I can't have it. Screw it. It's question mark. I want it like a lot. Yeah, I'm just gonna say screw it for now. Give me you. Oka Oka. A tubular mix of colorful spuds. Wait, they're supposed to be like. Supposed to be like. Um. 
Wow, I need to get rid of... Okay, I need to go home. Ow. I need to go home and get rid of all this stuff on me. Having these pulse slimes on me all the time is a really huge detriment because I can't... I need more space. I need the space, man. Space, man. Um, I have two. I'll give you one. Nothing? Dang. Okay. Well, I was kind of hoping that might have actually ended up exploding him. Uh, I have, like, no space for anything right now. So, right. I'm gonna take my, my beautiful collection of beautiful crystal slimes. I love them so much. And purple is kind of one of my favorite colors. I really, really love purple. And all its shades and hues. Alright, so what are we gonna do, man? Because... I'm like I'm having a lot of different ideas and thoughts and stuff of like that I need to get done and, and want to want to do. Um, I need puddle slime area. Um, I need crystal slime area, like specifically for the for the slimes. And you know what? They, the puddle slimes and the crystal slimes can hang out in the same area because I wanted to put them in the cave. Man, I really wanted to buy the area that I found the teleporter for, but it doesn't look like it's gonna happen actually. It really just doesn't look like it's gonna happen. So you know what I'm going to do? Is everyone fine? Is everyone is is anyone dead yet? These air nets seem to be holding. That's good. All right, everyone's still alive. Good. All right, so let's see. Uh, this oh, perfect timing. This needs a fruit, so I'll put the oka oka there. Uh, let's just collect these for now and uh, feed my rock guys. And then get rich off the porch they poop out of. Um, right. They also love veggies. Um, their, their porch ow, are like really expensive. Ow. So I'll give some to them. Uh, let me show these in there. Uh, right. Alright, so let's make a little detour. Let's give these stony hands off to my explosion dudes. It's gonna be a nice payday. Um, right. And I'll just deposit these stony hands over here for later days. Uh, alright, let's start selling some stuff. I need the money. Okay, I wish the collectors did their job a little bit quicker, but let's just go with it. Okay, so that's not much of a payday there, but... Okay, so I got an Oka Oka patch growing, and that's always nice to touch. Oh, man. Okay, it's always fun to play this game. I'm actually very happy that I'm back in it. It's fun. I like it, and it's an increased and it's an increased additional fun times when I get to play it for you guys. I just hope you guys are also having fun. Ooh, don't explode me. Uh, okay. So blah blah blah. Also, uh, let me know in the comments below um, what you feel, how, how you felt about me doing a, a live stream about it and then making it a technical episode. Cause I don't know if that's a great like method to go about things. I don't know if that was... I don't know if it maybe whoever's like following this series uh, maybe they got confused or whatever. I did mention it in the episode, so... but I don't know if that was not a great thing to do. Just let me know if you have any uh, negative opinion about that. Or positive opinion. <laughs> uh, that would be awesome too. Alright, so this should be the last of my harvest. I think I already picked up my boom parts. Let me dump these in the receptacle. Six dollars per pink port. Some pretty garbagey stuff right there, but hey, I got some money. This should be, this definitely should be enough money to go ahead and buy me the cave zone. Cave zone. Okay, I gotta remember to save up for the lab, but I can't do that right now. Alright, the grotto. A dark and gloomy cavern, blah blah blah. Let's do it. Let's go. Awesome. Now I can store my phosphor slimes too. Okay, so, um, I want to put the, what the heck, there's a cave back there, that's awesome. Okay, so, I remember in my last game, I used to put the puddle slimes in here. Um, I can't upgrade it any further, huh? Okay, well, there you go, buddy. There you go, guys. Hopefully, you guys will be a lot, oh, is he, oh, look at him. You guys are so cute. How do I, like, how do I take care of you guys? Do I need to do anything? Let me check the slime pita for the puddle slimes a little bit, because I want to make sure they're cool. <laughs> Diet water. Favorite none. Okay, puddle slimes are rare species of slime that live in fresh water pools found on the range. These slimes don't eat fruits, veggies, or meat, like most other slimes. Instead, puddle slimes deserve water into their bodies. 
While they sit on the surface of a pool, puddle slimes need fresh water to survive and it will quickly evaporate if left on any other surface for far too long. Uh, puddle slimes aren't risky to manage, they just require a fair bit of maintenance. A rancher needs a pool of fresh water like a pond, available for a puddle slime to sit in as they will evaporate if wa away from water. Additionally, puddle ports burst as soon as they touch anything but fresh water. Finally, puddle slimes are exceptionally shy and will not produce ports if they are in close proximity to more than three other slimes. Oh. So, I need like a second puddle. Okay, so now they're not shy because th they can they can handle having three dudes, three slimes around. But if there's more than three, they get shy. Okay, that's kind of a cool way to balance things out. I don't think I have enough money for a corral though, which sucks. Oh wait, I do. Awesome. Okay, how much for a high wall? Three fifty. Screw it. I'm doing it. Um, here you go, guys. Yeah, yeah. Oh man, I love you guys so much. I wish I could like have one specifically as my pet so you can follow me around and tell me how cool I am. <laughs> you guys are so cute. What do you guys eat again? I don't remember. What is it? Okay, you guys like veggies and odd onions. Well, do I have a surprise for you? I got a bunch of odd onions. Uh, whoa. Okay, I'm glad I put them in this corner back here. Let's uh. Give a quick gander over here in this direction just before I end the episode here. Ooh, what's that? Oh, it's a teleporter. Cool, but I have to unlock it, which is probably the rock gordo. Which is a little bit disappointing because I want a slime key pretty badly. How the heck am I going to get a slime key though? You know what? Screw it. I I'm going to give it a quick Google to see what the heck do I have to do for the treasure pods because so far I haven't been able to figure anything out. Um. And it's been quite a while. Hmm. But yeah, anyways, uh, thank you so much for watching. My name is Crystal Face. I hope you're having a good time. I'm so excited to have these crystal slimes around here. Holy crap, that is hazardous. That is very hazardous, and I'm going to need an internet soon. But uh, yeah, I'll catch you in the next episode. Uh, see you there.